This is Drom Shekasuto. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, how are you doing? Trying to... It's an amazing thing, you know, I'll, I'll share it with you. Look how, like, quiet to be, like, this area. It's because that everyone has such noise, like you stuck in a factory in the middle of, of, of such a, a hard and busy um, occupied place. So I kind of, like, thought to myself that it will be quiet, but... Uh, everyone must cut their lawns so it's like every week every neighbor every will be able to relax from the sound but hopefully soon the creator he knows exactly what to do with every individual where to take you and where to put you what to do with you and how to help you to come to the right uh, places that you need to to get I wanted to tell you that one of the thoughts that are um, very deep in my mind is that we have this um, important job of making things uh, simple like for an example and the geula that we're talking about like for many people people it's like what are you talking about I have a friend is watching us now. His name is Ethan Butler. This amazing person once uh, came to live to to visit for two weeks in uh, in the holy city of uh, Jerusalem. And um, while he was there, so we spoke, and he told me that only now he realized that Jerusalem was like an idea it was a concept in his mind he was learning years but it was kind of a spiritual aspect in Avodat Hashem but Yerushalayim Jerusalem is an actual city it's like there are houses over there trees like but only when you catch a flight and you go to the Holy Land of Israel and you walk in the neighborhoods and and like you you lean on on a wall. You smell the flowers. You buy something something in the in the shuk in the marketplace. So like only then you 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 really realize that there is a place that is called Jerusalem, and it's not only a spiritual hasaga, deep high understanding. It's like it's it's in reality. So also the redemption is exactly the same. It's similar. We can talk about the redemption, but in many ways, like it's, what are we talking about? And I feel like it's very important for us to put things on the table and just like to discuss it and to talk about it and to make things very simple and clear. So for that, I, the redemption will take place. So all the Holy Land of Israel um, will be rise to the holiness of the holy city of Jerusalem means that Jerusalem, Yerushalayim will conquer, will expand to the size of the holy, of holy land of Israel means going to cover it all in its holiness and that the land of Israel, the land itself will expand and will cover the whole world so it means that all the world will rise to that um, to that amazing um, holiness, holy level of the holy land of Israel. So yesterday at night, he knows that uh, I'm not so into Facebook and watching movies um, in our days. So he, he let me see some things in, in my mind when my eyes are closed and he literally opened my eyes and we all gonna be um, in that time of redemption and that the whole wide world will become in the holiness of the holy land of israel so for an example in the in the israeli independence day or in the day of yerushalayim the day that they set jerusalem free and um, so the world are celebrating 
and you see them going to the streets with flags, the, 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 the flag, the blue and white flag of the Holy Land of Israel, like going to the streets and celebrating and everyone are, are dressed up for that and, and by that they are bringing the holiness of Jerusalem, of, of, of the Holy Land of Israel, um, to their places, to their hometowns and the name of Israel becomes famous. Now for an example, another example, online people that love Am Israel, that they love the Jewish nation, that they love the Torah, so they're always posting things online on Facebook, whatever, and Instagram, like they're part of groups that are talking about um, Israel and, and friends of Israel and whatever and like always they're creating memes with Shabbat Shalom and advertising the menorah before of Hanukkah and matzot before of Pesach and whatever like they make the, the they're, they're distributing, they're sharing, they're, um, they're, they're advertising the Israeli concepts in their places like to their communities, to their friends online or or physically or whatever so it came to me that in that day i baruch hashem very thankful to hashem that he keeps on opening my my eyes and showing those things to me in in visions but literally i saw how like that love for am israel for for this like this issue of being israeli of like to be part of, of the Israeli nation or by recognizing yourself as a real Israeli soul or just by like joining them and loving them and caring about them it will be such an, an issue like it's gonna be such a great thing like everyone everyone will hold that page everyone will 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 be in that point and like everyone will that thing so the whole wide world will be covered with this holiness and everyone will be able to see like flags of israel will be all over the states like all over the the lands in all the cities in all the villages people will will like every child that will come and will born to the world in the day of redemption everyone will be called is israel like it to everyone like they're going to call them israel 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 like the um, in such a great way um, that um, that that the whole wide world will rise to the level of holiness of the holy land of of Israel. This is this is this is a, a practical, um, like um, realistic point of view. This is exactly how it will take place. Like everyone will know and everyone will recognize and everyone will understand and, and everyone will understand how important is the connection to the to the to the jewish people and to the holy and to the holy nation of israel and everyone will find their connection from their places and 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 that um inner inspiration will will find ways of expression and everyone will talk about it and everyone will feel that and everyone will desire that and everyone will will want to take part of it so so everyone will make those memes and everyone will make those flyers and everyone will hang those flags and 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 the world will shine with the light that been uh, been treasured in us i'm very proud to to be in israel i'm very happy that i have this um, I don't feel better than any other person that is not Jewish um, though like the fact that I'm Jewish is not uh, like it doesn't do anything for me like for me to be Jewish and from and to be from the tribe of God or the tribe of Asher or Naftali or Zvulun or Issachar it's like it's the same thing I, I am happy that around me there were people that could teach me like the tradition that I'll be able to learn and the fact that I was born Jewish helped me with that because around me there were many religious people so I had from who to learn but in reality every other person that is not Jewish but 
one day will understand that the roots of his soul are coming from the holy branches of the nation of Israel and like I said many times before we're talking about hundreds of millions of people that will one day wake up to understand oh man like I'm, I'm an Israeli I'm from the tribe of Asher I'm from the tribe of Ephraim of Naphtali of Zvulun like whoa like I am who I am like I'm Israeli so I I don't see the Jewish are like it's one family it's a it will always be depend in how much you as an individual invested and uh, and dedicated and sacrificed from your own life from your own pleasures from your own nonsense or to get rid of get over all your bad attributes your 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 negativity your sadness like it's it's a person will be rewarded not based on his race or or his nation or his like um, family tree like you cannot be rewarded for the fact that your uncle was righteous like if you were pure and if you were honest so you'll you'll get paid like from heaven they'll open your eyes to see more you'll you'll understand more and there is no greater reward than to to be committed to be involved to be part of what it goes on in reality like it's written in the book Likute Moran of Rabbi Nachman of Breslev that he said that the difference between the spiritual level of Moses that he was the head to all the prophets to the rest of the prophets is that Moses was serving the Creator in that aspect of schar mitzvah mitzvah that the reward on a mitzvah is the mitzvah itself like everyone are in 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 their aspects are desiring to be rewarded in the world to come like all right i did this and that so now i i deserve or i hopefully gonna get this and that like a reward i'll enjoy the world to come i'm gonna live forever uh, and and like I'm I'm gonna sit with the righteous ones, whatever. All those wonderful dreams that people are dreaming. But Moses, Moshe, he's not into those things at all. Like he's he's not hungry. He doesn't he doesn't need to feed his mind. Oh yeah, I'll be rewarded. He he wants to keep the mitzvah. Like that's his reward. Like that I want to do. Like and that's my reward that I'm able to do an amazing thing like me myself for an example I'm I'm so happy to do what that I'm doing like think about it at night I'm going to sleep and I'm asleep and I have almost 2,000 videos that are that are uh, that are waiting for people to watch on YouTube and on on Facebook on social media and like I'm I'm asleep and people in four wings of the universe are watching my videos like I'm asleep and I'm talking to you directly like while I'm asleep in the same time like people in Germany can watch me and I'm talking to them directly to their place and someone else in New Zealand he just like randomly looked for something connected to Judaism and he found my video and suddenly he's being so inspired and it's me, I'm talking to him while I'm asleep. Like, I'm in... Guys are driving scooters. People are from the UK and like uh, watching my videos while I'm asleep. Like, you know how how happy and grateful I am for, for this blessing that the Creator made something so so incredible the numbers of hours of Torah that I taught until today on social media is like millions of hours a person doesn't live even millions of hours and I already taught few hundreds of millions of 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 hours it's crazy like you cannot understand that's eternal life that's the clearest evidence that eternal life are are like is is possible it's just it happens while while you
Why you don't know exactly what's going on with you and, and like you're just like doing the best that you can suddenly the Creator is showing you that He can put you in, in thousands of how, houses in the same time and, and, and while you're asleep to see that and, and that's the reward that's the greatest reward of them all that you're that you're able to to do that your advice can help someone that you are helping that you that people find you useful and helpful and 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 that you you do something with your time i saw once a video on uh, on on jewish um holocaust survivors uh, the holocaust they joined the two groups and they went to revenge the nazis commanders like they were going no one sent them they themselves just like found it um, that it's like it's the most important thing to be done after being slaughtered millions of people been killed like their parents their siblings so after the war they just like went out of the camps and and went to revenge and and they killed of uh, of nazis officers that uh, like after the war went back to their previous life like nothing happened until now we were serving in the army and everything uh, like the following orders and now going back to to life like normal life after after murdering and slaughtering and killing thousands or or or, or tens of thousands of of Jewish people so those so those Jewish brave people went to to revenge after the war and uh, and one of those people said that he feels very proud uh, uh, of himself very happy that he was able to to take revenge because now there is nothing to do you cannot go now to to germany and to revenge you there is no one to revenge there is no one to there is nothing to do you can fight hatred you you can open the eyes of people to to help them to be aware to the fact that that hatred and 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 racism is stupid and that no one needs to to be so so twisted whatever you can try educate and 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 stop and protect other like lunatics that are going wild but to revenge you can't revenge grandchildren of of someone that committed crimes like 70 80 years ago like there is no revenge in that that's crazy so he was very proud of himself very happy that right after the war they were able to to take revenge and and really and to go and to 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 punish those uh, war criminals that were killing innocent men women and children just because of of empty hatred something uh, very pathetic and low so in a way I also feel very proud of myself that I'm able to do things while our generation is struggling and uh, I know that I can mark V on my uh, on the results of my actions in every hour and I believe that uh, that's the, the main source of motivation that I have to know that our activity and our work uh, find its way to the hearts of of you guys and that uh, that our advice and our wisdom is uh, is needed and required for you guys to succeed so thank you for being friends and may the creator bless us all as one and may this shabbat be beautiful and gorgeous and wonderful and that uh, we're going to experience and see the beauty of redemption with our own healthy eyes with a happy heart and a wishing soul shabbat shalom hope you enjoyed this video very much 
Please now remember to subscribe and like this video and share it with your friends to help spread faith in the world. For more, please visit amuna.com. May your light shine always and your requests should be answered with the greatest blessings. Amen.